What is going on today guys? Sticks 10 here and today we're going to take a look at some Go Battle League. We're in, back in the Great League and I'm going to run this team that the Arrow is running or at least he uh, had this team going. He told me about it and I thought man that actually sounds really good. Uh, if you ha aren't already follow him on uh, Twitch. He streams quite a bit. A lot of battles there. Really really good battler. And so I'm running Galvantula. I'm running uh, Volt Switch, Discharge, and then Bug Buzz. Uh, has a lot of coverage in GBL, and so I think it is pretty solid. The event, uh, by the time this video is up, is probably over uh, for catching those, so hopefully you guys got a good one. Uh, this one that I'm using is actually a rank seven PVP IVs, um, so definitely well worth it. Uh, has a lot of strong matchups, of course, against like water and then your flying types. Um, obviously, it's a little weak to um, to Altaria, but other than that, a lot of the other flying types it does really well against. Um, and it actually has a pretty good matchup against a lot of the grasses because of Bug Buzz and how quickly you can get to it. So here we go. I'm going to bring it back out, get a little bit of extra energy on it. And then you can see, let's see what comes in. It's Dugong. I'm just going to throw the Discharger right away. It's going to do a ton of damage if it goes unshielded. And there you can see shields are down. Um, so we actually, we do get taken out, but we got off a Discharge. We actually had another one ready to go, but just couldn't get it off in time. Uh, and then here, uh, I'm backing up uh, with uh, Azumarill and then Reggie Steel on the back. So I have a lot of good switch options. And so here against this uh, Azumarill, gonna be pretty close. Uh, since it's got Hydro Pump, uh, it does have a little bit better time against me. And then it's gonna be a race to see who gets to the charge move next. I think I'm going to get to it, but it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty close as far as because I think an Ice Beam might be able to take me out there. And we do get to the uh, to the uh, flash cannon so that's gonna KO and we do win the first match of this set uh, I've been using this team for a lot of battles uh, trying to get my rating back up and I will say it is uh, very solid in rank 8 has a lot of good coverages against a varied uh, varied opponents that you're gonna run into uh, the next th next battle here let's see what they're gonna lead oh it's actually Haunter okay so this is actually a pretty tough matchup for Galvantula, uh, we're going to throw those Volt Switches and we're going to see how many, um, and I think this is only going to be a Shadow Punch. No, it's actually a Shadow Ball. I must have miscounted right there. So, um, but since we shielded, this is going to be a Shadow Punch. And we double shield uh, to save our Galvantula to get Switch Advantage. They actually haven't used a shield yet, so we're going to throw a Discharge right away. Uh, it's actually a Reggie Steel, so discharge is fine, and we should be able to get to another one fairly quickly. You can see, it does it does a little chunk there? Um, definitely going to take several of them to KO the Reggie Steel, but the Volt Switches actually do add up fairly quickly. You can see how much damage it's doing, and we have enough now, and but we're going to get KO'd here, so just barely missed it. But we're going to bring out uh, Azumarill start doing some damage here they're going to switch out into a lowland raichu um, we're going to throw an ice beam and then we're going to switch into our reggie steel um, because i'm afraid they probably have grass knot on that uh, lowland raichu is what most people are running um oh and there's the grass knot okay uh definitely thunder punch would have been a better move there uh maybe they didn't see the switch it's possible Thought I was in quite a bit though before that, but maybe they clicked on it already. Anyways, uh, you can see uh, flash cannon not super effective, but um, going to chunk down this Alolan Raichu. The main thing is I want to get, um, I want to stay alive long enough to. There we go. We KO the Alolan Raichu. In comes Reggie Steel, and then at this point, um, I can survive a flash cannon. There we go, and he's gonna have to get to another one, so I'm just gonna keep throwing bubbles, um, and then we do win. Uh, he had a shield remaining, so uh, definitely pretty close, but very, very GG's there. Uh, let's see who we're going up against next. 
and uh, you guys can see Galvantula just gives you a lot of good options here. And so here we go against Meganium. I'm expecting a switch here, and there's the switch, and they switch into Swampert. Uh, we hold out for just a second, and there I'm gonna Hydro Cannon into my um, into my Azumarill. Uh, now I am gonna shield this because a lot of people have been running um, Sludge Wave, and so there's the Sludge Wave. Um, and then I'm just gonna keep charging a little bit, and then there we go with an Ice Beam. Try to get a shield, do some damage here. There's the shield. We should be pretty close to another one. Um, we actually overcharged just a little bit. I'm gonna shield up. And let's see, another sludge wave comes in. They actually switch into Meganium. So that's fine. We're gonna throw the ice beam and then we're gonna switch into Galvantula. Um, that got the last shield so that got now Galvantula can go hit a bug buzz. And this is going to do a ton of damage to Meganium. You can see one hit KO there. And they're going to bring back out. I'm guessing they're going to bring back out Swampert and try to try to get me. Uh, luckily, since we know it doesn't have Earthquake, it can't um, one-shot me. But Hydro Cannon going to do a lot of damage. Um, and then we're going to throw a Discharge. Um... I don't know, I might have been able to farm, I'm pretty close though, I don't think I could have farmed down. So we get a little bit of damage off into the Metacham that comes in. Um, I'm just going to guess it has Ice Punch and uh, and Power Up Punch. Some people are running, some people are running Dynamic Punch, um, which I think is probably the better option there. Uh, we're going to go hydro, hydro Pump into this. And then we're going to switch... Um, really, I'm just trying to burn some energy, basically. Now, if he keeps uh, power-up punching, that could be bad, but we're getting it down pretty low, and I think one flash cannon will KO here. So, GG's very well played there. Uh, definitely, um, yeah, and I think, I would I would guess they had this the secondary move Ice Punch on that one. Power-up punch, Ice Punch. Could have had Dynamic Punch in the back, I guess, but we don't know. Uh, and so here we go Galvantula versus Meganium expecting a switch here they're not switching uh, this is just going to be a frenzy plant I think yeah there we go and still not switching so I'm going to go for bug buzz here probably should have went discharge just because they were likely to shield here um, and then I'm going to shield this frenzy plant and they switch there to Altaria. Um, and I'm going to switch into Registeel. Um, the reason I switch into that is because they do have Meganium. So Registeel, a little bit of a liability uh, with shields down. Um, and I feel like this matchup is pretty good. Uh, Flash Cannon won't one hit KO. Uh, you can see it does quite a bit. Um, and we're going to, I mean, we can tank the Sky Attacks. The Dragon Breaths do add up over time. Um, just the amount of them to it you can see and we're gonna flash cannon here uh, Let's see if we get the last shield or if they uh, decide to just let okay. They do shield um, So and then they switch And see what switched in Flash cannon into a zoom reel. so that actually wasn't that bad. We switch into our own a zoom reel. We still have a shield So we're sitting in a pretty good position uh, what I want to try to do here is is win this. Oh, they have play rough. So so definitely going to be a hard time for me here. What I really want to do ideally is um, I kind of just want to die to this thing, I think. It would be the best play here. Let it KO me and then have them sw get, get out of there and then Meganium comes back in. So here's the Hydro Cannon. Um, and then I'm going to switch into my, um, oh, and it died. Great. Registeel comes in, we shield up, uh, man. Yeah, I, I don't know. That was, that was bad play on my part. Um, definitely should have let the, I think if the Azumarill would have taken me out, then I could have got a little bit extra energy on my uh, Galvantula and then 
but it was pretty low HP. Everything was low HP, and I think that was the problem. They switch into uh, into Metacham, and I switch into a Zumarill here for this next battle, and they're gonna throw an Ice Punch at me, which is obviously gonna be resisted. Um, still going here. So I'm not gonna shield this one either. There's another Ice Punch. And we're gonna throw an Ice Beam here. Let's see if they decide to shield it. They do not, so we're just gonna farm down at this point. Um, and here, um, I do decide to shield here, and I think, yeah, there's the Dynamic Punch. So that would've done a little bit more than Ice Punch, obviously. And uh, in comes the Victory Bell Shadow Edition with the Razor Leaf, so that's gonna KO me pretty quick. Do get an Ice Beam off, so we get a shield at least. Uh, Galvantula can come back in, and we're going to throw a Discharge. Um, they're likely to shield this. I think. Nope, they decide not to. So uh, one more Discharge is going to finish it off, though. I decide to shield um, just because I am kind of low on health. And we're actually going to be able to just Discharge it down. Or Sorry, I mean Volt Switch it down, and then we throw a Discharge into whatever came in. I missed the... And it's actually Provo Pass, so we switch immediately into our Registeel. Uh, not a whole lot they can do here. I do bait the shield here. Um, and let's see if we get it. We do. And then we can go for a uh, Focus Blast, and that's going to finish the game. And there's the Thunderbolt, not enough to KO. And there's the Focus Blast. I'm glad they changed that animation. A lot easier to get... Uh, a lot higher. It looks like they quit out uh, right <laughs> in during the charge move. So GG's, uh, very well played. We end up uh, four and one in that set. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that featuring Galvantula. Special thanks to Arrow for showing, uh, telling me what that team was, and hopefully you guys will follow his Twitch channel down below. I want to thank my uh, Patreon supporter as always. Uh, if you guys haven't already, check out that link. Check out the benefits down there. And guys, like, comment, subscribe, and keep on battling.